Okay, so now I'm going to show you how to use the step and pivot with the plumb. So even when you're drilling, you're always going to defend yourself uh, from the plumb. So when I do the plumb, I cross my wrist and not put my gloves. And I don't pull on this edge just like this. I do this so I can leverage. See the difference in leveraging? I'm going to try to cut on his neck with my forearms. My hips are away as opposed to squared up. They're, they're away. He's trying to defend by pulling himself up to looking up and squishing in my elbow. Okay, so that's kind of the pressure that I feel when we're training and I steer with my elbows. So on that first lesson I taught you, I step, I pivot, and I rip them. And I have a glove on the pulling side and a glove on the pushing side, and I drive the knee. And I always try to make contact with the kneecap as much as possible. So that was one of the drills that I taught you. So now you can see it's from the plumb. I step, I pivot, I rip them, and I knee. I have that plumb, fighting, step, pivot, rip, knee. Step, pivot, you see the rip, push, pull, and knee. I'm going to show you how you feed the energy for your partner trying to do that. So that we both will get something from the drill. So he's plumbing, crossing his wrists. And right away I look up, I keep my head close to the chest as he's practicing. And he learns to step, pivot, and there I am still pressuring in. And boom, and defend. Now right here you have to be careful when you're in practice because an elbow can be struck to my face. So he was busy doing the, the knee and I'm busy controlling the elbow so I don't get elbowed. So throughout all the drills, even though we're just working on knees or just working on a certain hand grip, I'm always aware of the elbow strike. So go ahead again. This is the plumb, I'm controlling his elbow. Step pivot, boom, controlling his elbows. Countering, I let him get it, pushing in. Right, we're gonna work on that plumb. You wanna get that plumb. Squeeze in those elbows, control my shoulders, and then step, pivot, and there my way soft. I control the elbow. Now we can add some things. When I step and pivot, I rip them. So to see that, when I step, I step and I start to open my elbow and I pull push, I, I jerk on the body, right? So no matter how I step, I rip them, right? I'm always step, pivot, you see I rip them. I'm always trying to guide with the twisting of the head and neck, as opposed to what most people do, they try to rip the whole body, where I'm just trying to twist your head and neck. So we get a little bit more twist in the neck, as you step and pivot. And there's that opening, I block the elbow and he comes in, boy. And I fight for position again. He's getting his position back. Keep them elbows in, work those elbows. That's it, controlling the elbows. Step and pivot, pivot, control the elbow, boom. Fighting for position, now I have the plumb. I step, pivot, rip, oi, oi. And that's your basic <laughs> step. That's your basic uh, step and pivot, and uh, your first kind of grip that I've shown you, which is what we call the plunk. Thank you. Pow! Yes. Got it.